King Charles III is set to be crowned at his coronation on Saturday, May 6, 2023 and a whole host of celebrities are expected to join. Some of those who have been awarded honors in the past are expected to be there on the special day as well as those who are simply friends and relatives of the royal family. The King, 74, will make his way from Buckingham Palace to Westminster Abbey at 10.20 a.m., ready for the beginning of his coronation at 11 a.m. Some stars have already been rumored to have been invited to the special day. Joanna Lumley, David, and Victoria Beckham, Stella McCartney, Bear Grylls and Rowan Atkinson are expected to be amongst the lineup. Musician Lionel Richie, French President Emmanuel Macron, King William Alexander and Queen Maxima of the Netherlands, Prime Minister Rishi Sunak and US First Lady Jill Biden will be there but her husband President Joe Biden will not be attending. Here is a rundown of what celebrities have been spotted in their finery arriving at the special event, Ant and Dec TV stars Ant and Dec said there were over the moon to be invited as they spoke to Good Morning Britain ahead of the ceremony. The iconic TV duo, 47, admitted they thought they were being pranked when they received the invite to the momentous occasion. Ant and Dec wore matching tuxedo suits to the event, with light grey waistcoats, black blazers, black ties, white shirts and grey and black striped trousers. Speaking on Good Morning Britain today, Ant said, It is a privilege, an honour and a privilege, to be here today. While Dec said getting an invite was surreal. He added, it's quite surreal when the invite comes through and it's quite an ornate invite and it comes through the door and you think, hang on a minute, is it finally our time to get wound up? Is someone having us on here because this is a really good wind up and no, apparently it was true and here we are. Emma Thompson Love Actually star Emma, 64, was photographed in a stunning satin red coat with a floral pattern on, which she wore on top of a black dress as she waved at royal fans as she entered the abbey. She styled her short locks in a gorgeous curly do and glowed with a natural touch of makeup. Dame Emma has a friendship with the king and previously said dancing with Charles was better than sex. She previously added to Vanity Fair, there's a long history of relationships between princes of Wales and actors, not just actresses, not just the rude relationships as, Charles, would say, though God knows I've tried. He wasn't having any of it. Joanna Lumley Dame Joanna Lumley was photographed on the grounds of Westminster Abbey in a chic black and white ensemble this morning. The absolutely fabulous icon wore a black dress, with a white Peter Pan collar which she wore with a pair of black tights, flat shoes and a classy white hat with a black brim to tie in with her dress. Lionel Richie Lionel Richie was spotted grinning from ear to ear as he joined those attending the historic occasion today. Hello singer Lionel, 73, looked stylish in a black tuxedo with a silk off-white tie and shite shirt. Lionel is also expected to perform at the coronation concert after the king is crowned today. He gushed over the once-in-a-lifetime opportunity ahead of the ceremony. Lionel said, to be a part of it is everything. This doesn't happen every day. So, am I excited about this? Absolutely. This is not like any other time in life or any occasion. Once the lights hit and the music starts it's just going to be magical. I have to pinch myself. We're walking in history. Katy Perry ahead of her performance at the coronation concert later today, Katy Perry was spotted in a flamboyant lilac ensemble at Westminster Abbey this morning. 
The 38-year-old wore a large lilac fascinator hat with a lace brim along with a fitted dress of the same color along with a matching short-sleeved blazer on top, with a purple flower on. She added a large Vivian Westwood pearl necklace with her iconic logo as the clasp along with a white handbag of the same designer brand. Nick Cave singer Nick Cave, 65, was pictured looking smart in a black suit with a matching waistcoat and tie as he entered the Abbey. He clutched onto what appeared to be the order of service for the coronation as he made his way into the ceremony. Earlier this week, Nick slammed celebrities snubbing Charles' coronation invitation. He was asked why he wasn't going to the coronation and responded with a lengthy message, which read, I am not a monarchist, nor am I a royalist, nor am I an ardent Republican for that matter, what I am also not is so spectacularly incurious about the world and the way it works, so ideologically captured, so damn grouchy, as to refuse an invitation to what will more than likely be the most important historical event in the UK of your age. Magician Dynamo and Kelly Jones British Magician Dynamo has been spotted arriving at Westminster Abbey today. He is connected to King Charles as he is an ambassador for the Prince's Trust after being given a startup loan by the initiative, which he said changed his life Dynamo, real name Stephen Frayne, said, The Prince's Trust gave me the support no one else would and it changed my life, that's real magic. Alongside him is Stereophonics frontman Kelly Jones. The band also received help from the Prince's Trust, being able to buy music equipment which enabled them to perform.